Welcome to this video, I will show you how to download Vanilla Tool and how to get it set up. First head to VanillaTool.com, click on Download at the top bar. Click on Download here, you also see the password for it here, it is VT. Once the file is downloaded, open it and enter the password VT, it will unpack itself and open the file explorer in the correct folder, at this point you may get some antivirus prompts, don't mind them for now, they probably removed some files. If you only have Windows Defender there is a script that will add exclusions for you automatically. All you have to do is right-click on the Windows flag at the taskbar, for Windows 10 choose, PowerShell, Admin, for Windows 11 choose, Terminal, Admin. Back on the Explorer window that got opened by the Vanilla Tool package, click on the bar that shows the path, copy the full path into your clipboard. Back on the console window, type CD, space, quotation mark, and then paste the path from your clipboard and add again a quotation mark to the end, submit with enter. We need to allow the execution of scripts at this point. For that you have to enter, set, minus, execution policy, space, unrestricted. Submit with enter. You have to confirm, on a English Windows OS just type, Y, like it shows here. And the last step is to execute the script that adds the necessary exclusions, for that type an ampersand. Then a space. Quotation mark. A dot followed by a backslash. And then, Windows underscore Defender underscore exclusion. Again a dot, then, PS1. And lastly another quotation mark. Submit with Enter. Congratulations you've added exclusions for Vanilla Tool in Windows Defender. This was probably the hardest part. You can close the console window and go back to the Explorer window, go one directory back, you are probably in your downloads folder now, open the Vanilla Tool package file again, the password was VT. We unpack the file again so it restores the files that initially got deleted by our antivirus. In case you already paid you can open the account manager file now. On the very left side you can change the client region, if the region you play on is not available, the account manager couldn't detect some necessary paths. To correct it you have to click on the gear icon here. Then go to Setup Paths. Here you can enter the necessary client and launch your paths. Back on the main window of the account manager, it is pretty straightforward how to use it, you basically just choose the region on the left side and then you enter your credentials, on Ion EU it is a bit more complicated to add an account but you get instructions throughout the process when you do. Once the account is added you simply press login. The account manager will start the game and bypass the anti-cheat. It will also start a vanilla tool process for each Ion client it starts. In game you can press insert to toggle the overlay menu. You can navigate with your arrow keys. Thanks for watching.